We got matchup fights and we got title run fights and we got the big money fights. Welcome to this week's MMA studio. And I'm proud to announce no USADA news today. My name is Anders Kvall and I will try to keep you updated on whatever happens in the magnificent world of MMA. UFC 201. Last Saturday, one of the most brutal fighters in the UFC, Robbie Lawler, lost his belt to Tyron Woodley. Woodley earned his moment in the sun by winning the UFC welterweight title with a first round knockout of Robbie Lawler at the Phillips Arena in Atlanta. A massive right hand and a phenomenal finish. Straight after his title belt win, Woodley tried to get a money fight by calling out Nick Diaz. Robbie Lawler wants, of course, a rematch. And after his incredible title run, he might be in the position to make that happen. Robbie Lawler said in the post-fight press conference that deserving it and getting it are two different things. In the female division, Karolina Konovalchik used some impressive knees and outperformed Rus Namajunas in the clinch for a decision victory. And the table is now set for a Polish power matchup between Karolina Konovalczyk versus Jajecik. Jake Ellenberger, who the UFC considered cutting, had one last chance to prove himself on Saturday. He took his chance and finished off Matt Brown in the first round. With vicious body kicks and hard hitting, it was one of the finest performances of his entire career. Very impressive and not what we all expected for the fight. This might be the biggest upset of the weekend. And finally, a veteran bout between Ross Pearson and Masvidal. This was a very important fight for Ross Pearson who has moved up to the welterweight since his last fight only three weeks ago. Ross Pearson definitely in big trouble when his scorecard suffers yet another loss. Masvidal got his much earned win and will still be a force to be reckoned with in the UFC rooster. He's got one of the most impressive fight cards, 44 professional fights in total, and he joked about it in his winner interview with Joe Rogan. That's all for now, and thank you for watching, and subscribe, and we will try to keep you updated on whatever happens in the magnificent world of MMA.